Hello everyone, I'm Alicia Woodruff and welcome to The Fort Report. You may have noticed a mile-long train working its way along the track in East Fort Worth lately. One with dozens of workers scurrying along beside it? Well, that's because it's part of Union Pacific Railroad's efforts to reconstruct rail lines between Fort Worth and Dallas. Union Pacific's track renewal train, known as the TRT-909, is a one-of-a-kind tool that allows Union Pacific to perform maintenance to its infrastructure more efficiently and quickly by replacing an entire rail corridor during one continuous project. The machine has evolved a lot. The operation is state-of-the-art now. It's got a lot of new technology from when we first started doing it. We started in Fort Worth on Thursday, and we've already covered uh, six and a half, seven miles. So as you can see, we moved pretty swiftly across the railroad. Nearly 50 pieces of equipment make up the several-mile-long convoy that supports the TRT-909 project. These include an in-track welder, several tampers, a rail train for loading used rail, a multi-purpose machine for ditching and material removal, and other specialty equipment. If there's nothing in front of us, we can lay up to three miles of track a day. If there's a lot of obstacles ahead of us, that kind of dictates the speed of the machine. So it's more efficient for us, clearly a, a higher cost to our operation, but we, we figure it's a good way to come through a metropolitan area, get through here fast so we don't have to impact our railroad as well as the communities as many times as we normally would. It's pretty cool to see. And if you can't get out to the tracks to check it out, you can see a video on YouTube about the technology. Just search for new TRT video on YouTube. And a quick shift from iron horses to cowboys and horses. The 117th Fort Worth Stock Show and Rodeo kicks off January 18th. 23 days of pure Western fun. It's Fort Worth tradition for show regulars and new visitors. It's family fun, it's a Western heritage, it's a big part of the tradition of Fort Worth. We have everything from rodeo action to livestock, um, Carnival and Midway, unique shopping. There's just a whole lot to see and do. There's, we have live music on, a, on the Coors Light stage every evening. So there's, there's, just, there's a lot for everyone to do. Always a highlight is the Stock Show Parade, which is at 11 a.m. on January 19th this year. Nearly 100,000 spectators line the streets of downtown annually for this big event. And the unique thing about the Stock Show is, is it's always free, it always has been and always will be free to go to the Stock Show Parade. But this year we have a new twist to an old tradition and we're using bleacher style seating. And it's very limited, it's in some of the sections of uh, the parade route. The tickets are $15. But that ticket, they, people will want to keep their tickets if they do purchase those seats because it also serves as general admission to the stock show any time during the 23-day run of the show. For more about this year's stock show and for information on tickets, parking, and more, just visit the show's website. Here's a look at other events happening in and around Fort Worth through the rest of January. For a listing of more events and city meetings, you can always check the calendar at the city's website.